Artist Ava Arpo hangs up another cell phone. A spider web of ropes waits to catch its next victim. Cell phones given up for 24 hours by people who want to see if they can survive without them. It's a uh, good riddance, I say, for the day. It's just a cell phone. I think we can do without it for a day. This installation has been widely publicized, but it's easy to see not many people have been willing to contribute. The artists have had difficulty getting more than about 50 phones. Yeah, they like the idea, but then after thinking some more and trying to imagine how it would be to be 24 hours without a mobile phone, some people really trying to find some excuses why they cannot do it. You should take interview with this guy. <laughs> well, it's not just a cell phone, it's a pacemaker. It's here all the time. <laughs> So what are the artists trying to say with this piece? That the cell phone is everywhere. Suddenly, it's so much part of our lives, so much uh, part of our society, and it has actually changed uh, our behavior. So uh, we just want to emphasize that it is a big change. The artists admit they're addicted to their own phones, so they're not trying to stop others from using theirs. It's just a way to get people thinking. And maybe some people will see that we don't need to rely on it as much as we think we do. The artists want to take their work to Tokyo and New York now and see how many people there are willing to give up their phones. David Giroux, CBC News, Edmonton.